With this series of throw-ins here, now the ball's back live in play. Polisina trying to spark things to life. Deflected off Seaman and a shot on the spin! Julia Grosso! What a great finish! Melbourne City strike first, and it's their left wing back, Julia Grosso, with striker's instincts that makes it Melbourne City 1, Sydney FC 0. Just a second A-League women's goal. The pass was deflected, and Grosso, oh, she is a natural left footer, and used it to brilliant effect there. Abby Lemon, the quick head check, but that deflection, it just set up perfectly, and a well-timed volley. And Julia Grosso, who could be conservatively described as a hype woman at the best of times, absolutely elated and over the moon. You see her teammates there just trying to pin her down. Inside. Neat build-up from Melbourne City. Policina keeps it moving off the feet of Galich. And then deep in attack. Look at the enthusiasm of Grosso to win the ball back and win a corner. And that was tenacious defending from the front from Julia Grosso. The American who had not played professionally before coming to Australia straight out of college. You see there the crunching challenge on Seaman and able to win the corner off in traffic. Everything would have to go right from here for City to score, but Torby may have one last burst at the end of the half. Grosso, one goal already. Policina, it sets up. Barriera, Policina, it wasn't cleared off the line in time. It matters not. City get a third regardless. Torby. Grosso. Great first touch, able to open up the right side of the pitch. Grosso still advancing. We want that left foot. And slows down just a little, waiting for runners down the right. Grosso and Torpy, the fullbacks, combining on the same side of the pitch. And now Torpy, a pass. Grosso now, right foot tentatively in. McLean heads it away. Grosso now following up. Ekic, Wilkinson waits in the middle. Oh, and, and the given, you see the referee with the arms outstretched in the middle of the pitch. And here goes Grosso. Battle of Americans. Grosso against Thompson. Grosso jags inside, shooting Julia Grosso. And Jar Wyman is over. Grosso. Ekic brings the ball down. Well, winning 3 0 last time Melbourne City ventured up to face the. Grosso. Precious moments now. Just over 10 minutes to play. This is a great run from Julia Grosso. Gets by so many. And draws a yellow card from the substitute. And a compatriot, Sarah Daffalonia. Her efforts today can't be understated, Julia Grosso. Well, if you miss time a challenge on Grosso, it's very easy to do because She's just so powerful and skillful. And that's exactly what's happened there. Zapolonia lunges in and collects Grosso. City's player of the year last year, Julia Grosso. Pretty uh, underrated or understated acquisition from Melbourne City. One of those players that came in and not too many people knew about it but has really come into her own. Well, if they didn't know her then, they certainly know her now. And she's been absolutely immense for this city side in both seasons. His first full season as a head coach in the league. Julia Gross Grosso wins out that battle. Yeah, quite a difference there in, in journeys, but the other element of this is the crossover between players in both teams where we've seen... We've seen it with a busy game early on. Just seven minutes gone. Here's Grosso. Does well to get past Mackenzie Wider. How Wilkins. Here's Grosso. Just can't do so. Here's Grosso. Otto. The Americans linking up. The Melbourne City have to be careful. At the moment, it's paying dividends. Here's Grosso. Driving forward down that left-hand side. Policina. 
That is Callum Knight, former Melbourne City player as well. At the base of midfield is Grosso. Driving through midfield, great ball out wide for Garlich. Putting it back across the face, Hannah Wilkinson can't turn it in. They'll get another opportunity. Grosso has been sensational so far today. She has, she's causing victory all sorts of trouble on that left, that run just then. She displayed great balance and power going forward. Showing prowess, inverting and going out wide, overlapping here. Grosso cutting back, Garlich in the box, options in the middle, brought down by Wilkinson, the strike this time! To keep it out of goal. That's experience there, it was an awkward spinning, bouncing shot there from Hughes, but Williams does really well, unsurprisingly. Policy is stopped. Against her former side, Grosser. However, when City get out, those transitions are hurting them. Here's Grosso. Came back inside, back out. Gets past one and her compatriot. His Garlic has already created three chances this game. Garlic, can she create one more? Grosso, really picking up those central areas. Almost. Start out wide for Grosso. Garlich continues her run. Seen it so many times today. Here's Grosso. A nice synergy on this left hand side. Wilkinson. Fairly quiet so far today. No necessarily clear cut opportunities for the big number nine. And Grosso does so well to evade Wynant. Policy. Albert City very good at playing around the press. Nice ball speed. Here's Grosso. Does well to buy herself some space. Cutting it across the face. Palmed away. We've seen with plenty of chances. Julia Grosso with a great game as well. So busy. She's just so hard to contain. And her and Galich running amok on that left side. Combining well. Stopped. Grosso. A fantastic first half from the American. Policina. Here's Garlich. Grosso. Cutting it across the face. It's a great ball. They may get another opportunity. Laura Hughes. Winding up. Can't hit the target though. And it was a great ball in. I just couldn't quite punish. Well, here's City's first foray. Wine it. Towards the byline, marked well by Grosso. And does get rid of it. It's been sensational today, Julia Grosso. And isn't that Coming on the experienced head. Here's Grosso. Coming to the byline. Here's Henry. Sarah D'Apollonia on now, going down as Policina waved on. Here's Ekic. Grosso. Ekic once more. Great ball through for Grosso to the byline. Here's Grosso. Down the line now, blocked by Alana. They've got their fans right behind that goal, perhaps spurring them on as well. Still plenty of time for either side to get one. And wouldn't it just be poetic if Melbourne Victory managed to snag one after Melbourne City have dominated the entire game? Well, they've got the majority of the crowd. What an entertaining match. Hard to believe it's already been nine rounds. Slightly puzzling. The play goes on. Grosso. In for Wilkinson. The moment is precious. Privatelli. Chance of a handball, but she keeps going. 
Privatelli blocked by Grosso.